When Mark Jenkinson was just a parliamentary candidate for the Conservative Party in Workington, I asked him a question at the local hustings. It's a question that I suspect was asked up and down the country once people got a look at the Tory party manifesto. It's a question about the balance between the government, parliament and the courts. Mr Jenkinson's answer, a recording of which is linked below, was predictable enough. He told the party line, he talked about getting the right balance. At no point did he mention any plan to remove the need for parliamentary scrutiny altogether. The other link below leads to a debate on an amendment of the Brexit withdrawal bill. It's an amendment that would guarantee the right of Parliament to scrutinise the bill as it progressed through the House. Every single Tory MP present, including my own MP Mr Jenkinson, voted against that bill, as did the DUP. They actually voted to remove their own right to scrutinise this most important of bills. They removed their own right to see, to review, to amend and even approve the parliamentary bill for Brexit, the withdrawal bill. But that's not all. They set a very dangerous precedent. British democracy is rapidly becoming a Boris Johnson dictatorship. Barely a month has passed since the general election, and in that time Boris has already sidelined both MPs and the courts. We're moving closer and closer to an enabling act. Be afraid. Be very afraid.